We all love watching running content on YouTube and we all have our favourite running YouTubers. We all know the big names. Specifically in the UK, the leading running YouTube channel is without question The Running Channel. Then of course, not far behind, we have James Dunn who's been around for years, as has Ben Parks. Along with Stephen Scullion and Ben is Running, these guys have well over 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. Then you have Ben and Mary from This Messy Happy, The Run Testers, Philly Bowden, Lloyd from Run For Adventure and Flora Beverly, they all have over 50,000 subscribers. I am talking specifically UK based though and I do apologise if I've missed anyone out all great channels and I pretty much watch all of them. Indeed, some of them are good friends of mine. But today I thought I'd highlight seven specific running YouTube channels in the UK that have fewer than 5,000 subscribers. Now I've not chosen these channels because of their awesome production values or the slick editing techniques. I've not chosen them because of the fancy snazzy merchandise. I haven't chosen them because of their expert training tips or indeed their in-depth shoe reviews. What else is there? Hopefully over the next few minutes by showing you a few clips and explaining why I enjoy watching these channels, you'll realize why I've highlighted them today. Oh, well, that's all right then. First off, and in no particular order, by the way, it's time on feet. Now, I don't know what it is about running YouTubers called Ben, but here's another one. Ben started his channel about three years ago with his partner, Carla. They are from the Brighton area and they mainly do trail and ultra running, but actually looking at his channel, some of his most popular videos are in fact his shoe reviews. What I like about Ben and Carla, and we have met plenty of times in person, is how chilled and down to earth they are. Ben never shouts in his videos like I do. He's never overexcited or desperate in his attempts to get you to watch. Their videos document two everyday runners as they venture into ultra running and their love and passion for running and the outdoors comes across so warmly in Ben's edits. Do you want some watermelon? I do, actually. <laughs> Review of the watermelon. <laughs> Still good. It got a bit it got a bit bashed around in my bag. I'll link a couple of options to get you started with time on feet in the description below. And by the way, congratulations to Ben and Carla who very recently got engaged. Next up we have Park Run legend Nicola Forward and her channel Nicola Runs. Nicola has done nearly 700 park runs and she started filming her adventures around three years ago. One video drew me to Nicola and I'll link it down below. It's a heartbreaking account of Nicola going out on a solo run to commemorate the death of her husband. And I defy you not to shed a tear or feel incredible empathy towards Nick in that video. Ben was 30 when he found out he had a brain tumour and um, he was lucky that, you know, we got to get married and have Poppy, but it's just, uh, it's just not fair. However, what strikes you most about Nicola in her videos is her insatiable positivity, her zest for life and her love for running. Good evening. I'm here in South Wales. Look at this beach. It's so beautiful. I'm just totally in love with the Wales Coast Park. She doesn't just do park run either. She's done multi-day events and 100 mile races and she is forever smiling and thanking the volunteers and trying to keep up with her equally positive daughter. She has a way of talking to you on camera which makes you feel like you're her best mate and I really love that about Nicola Forward. Oh, hi, Rich Keeble here. Hey, Rich uh, Keeble here. Not him again. Rich Keeble is an actor. I mean, a mostly out of work actor who fills his free time making running videos but he's very good at it if you like watching middle-aged men complaining about back pain. I've had a bit of an accident 
When it happened, I felt like I was gonna die. I love his videos for their open, frank honesty, but also for that slightly skewed, dark humor. He could spend 10 minutes telling you about his latest acting job, and then five minutes telling you how he hurt his foot in the shower. He's just as likely to show you B-roll footage of an overflowing refuse bin as he is the beautiful scenery in the park that he's running through. He's deliciously sardonic and another YouTube runner who doesn't shout at you when he talks. His voice is soft and unnervingly reassuring. Oh, hi, Rich Keeble here. Oh, and welcome to... Well, that's never happened before. I haven't actually been running that much and uh, the reasons will become clear as the video unfolds. He is bound to say or do something in a video which will make you either laugh out loud or cover your face in embarrassment. I'll link a couple of examples down below. Before we continue, if you are enjoying watching this video, if you're finding it entertaining, then please do consider subscribing to the channel. And then actually like and subscribe. And while you're on, why don't you go and subscribe to all the channels featured in this video. So we've just looked at the official times. Here's our previous PBs. Bam. That's, That's our, our PB new now. <laughs> Rayleigh's Adventures is Hayley and Ryan. And they're part of a growing group of Midlands-based runners like Andy from It's On Andy and uh, the two running brooms and Donato and another running YouTuber who we will feature next. Ryan is a super fast runner and their videos are a lovely mix of Hayley who has a more relatable pace uh, and Ryan who's a more sub elite runner and watching him battle for the win. Their presenting style is really relaxed and they both spend time in front of camera both presenting and commentating on each other's runs. That was rough. <laughs> it felt like two entirely different races. So the first one was like I was really packed in and oh. really struggling to get going. Therefore, I then shot off, killed myself. <laughs> and then the second one was just me on my own getting overtaken. Uh. <laughs> they do like their stats, which they show with on-screen graphics, and they are fans of the head cam. What I really like about Rayleigh Adventures is that they clearly just love running and they love traveling to their latest adventures. That really comes across on camera. Hayley's smile is absolutely infectious and Ryan's speed is really impressive. Again, links in the description. On, on to our, our next adventure. adventure. Staying in the Midlands now and Tim's middle-aged man running channel or MARM as it's known. The main events are the intro and the outro. Two years ago, they blocked me on their social media. It's completely unnecessary. Never forgotten it. I've taught them a right lesson by entering all their events. But um, yeah, hurts when you get that sort of rejection because after all, I'm just a, a middle-aged bloke just standing in front of a race events company asking for them to love me. Although that said, we always like a mid-run game of mints or mints. Time for a game of mints or mints, I think. But back to this intro, which Tim normally does in a car on the way to a race, normally a 10K or a half marathon, somewhere in the middle of the country. And he'll normally meet up with Donato or Andy Maguire or Hayley and Ryan or Brett from the OB1 brand channel. Tim can talk for England and he'll tell you about random events in his day which have either annoyed him or amused him with a dry, sarcastic wit or a deadpan expression. I can't stand in there now at that race briefing. I just can't. I thought I'd have a wild wee, but I didn't notice that I was urinating down myself. So even though I'm going to say to people, look, it's not what it looks, it's exactly what it looks. And the outro is delivered in the same way, usually bemoaning the course or another runner or his fitness. To be fair though, he's not a bad runner at all with some pretty decent times. That was it, Marmers. That was the Warwick to Kenilworth Two Castles run. Well, then his wife was there. I met Andy at the start. I met Rich at the start. I met 
Hayley from Rayleigh's. I've got to tell you actually, Julie, member of the Marmy Army, we had a lovely conversation by the massage tables. Said at the end, can I just say, you're a lot smaller than I thought you were. I'm like, Julie, you better not be looking at my shorts. Fans of the channel are known as Marmas. And if you're a true fan, you have to own one of the cherished Marm mugs. Next is another channel that's local to me, but a channel that is definitely on the rise with some captivating videos and a genuinely unique style. You can see the guy in the red top has been a bit more bold and aggressive now. He's at least five or six seconds up the road and his d is gonna have to get his elbows out here. <laughs> No, put that away, D Mills. That's not what I meant. Crown My Run are three brothers, Jody, Damien, and Will, but better known as J Mills, D Mills, and W Mills. They use the head cam and on screen graphics like Haley and Ryan to very good effect. But the one standout thing about this channel is J Mills' commentary. And it's six and a half K. The monster has arrived on my heels. He is creeping into those 195 heart rate, ladies and gentlemen. But I just don't think this guy has any respect for consequences. All he cares about is destroying my life as we get a little bit of a D Mills death call there. 3.4K to go. You'd think he wouldn't be able to get there. But he loves ruining my life. Has done since the day I was born. And he's now half a second behind me. Hello. Oh, look at us exchanging pleasantries. This man should be on the telly. I don't think his commentaries are scripted. I think he just wings it. But he's got a quick wit and a nice way with words. You'd think watching a 20 minute POV headcam video of Parkrun would be a bit dull, but far from it. It's absolutely hilarious. Jay Mills is a legend and you find yourself getting into the action and rooting for D Mills, usually the subject of the video, to gain that elusive Parkrun podium position. You can see the finishing line in the distance. We're going at three minutes, seven seconds per kilometer. He's going to need to get into the twos for any hope of the podium now, but it looks like it's getting away from him. Where is the trademark D Mills kick? I'm not seeing it today. I really am hoping that in the future I can get W Mills to Worthing for a head to head at Parkrun. Uh, he's the only one of the three brothers that I stand any chance of beating. Finally, we're saving one of the best till last. All the channels that we've featured today have something unique and brilliant about them, which I absolutely love. But Al Pepper is guaranteed to bring a smile to your face. What is happening, my little peppers? Rarely do you come across somebody so full of positivity and zest for life. Hey, how you doing? Oh, yeah, yeah. Are you all right? Guys, who's the fastest club in the Northeast? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, how you doing? You all right? How you doing? You all right? How you doing? Good to see you. How you doing? You all right? How you doing? You all right? Hi guys. How's it going? You all right? He might be a thoroughly miserable guy in real life, or he might be a complete nightmare of bounciness, but in his videos, he comes across so well, smiles all the time, chats to everyone, really engages with you, the viewer, and with the people he's running with. And if you can count the number of fist pumps he gives in a single video, then you're a better person than I am. The guy is already a legend in the northeast of England where he's from and where he'll film anything from a park run to a multi-day ultra race. He's not the fastest runner in the world, but he makes up for that with his energy on camera. He's funny, he's honest, he's genuine. He loves people, he loves the outdoors, he loves his running, and that genuinely shines through in every video he makes. Nice How's it going? You, it's going good, oh, man. Enjoying it so far? Yeah, good, yeah. Nice atmospheric conditions. <laughs> yeah, Misty. Wind, it's not raining. Exactly. What more can we ask for? That's Perfect. summer. That's Perfect. summer in Scotland. It's like summer in the UK. Uh, definitely. <laughs> nice, well, good to meet you after watching yeah, you for so too, long. Man. Channel good. Shall I shout out? Yeah, run for adventure. Nice. Yeah. You guys already know that. <laughs> Go now and subscribe to Al Pepper's channel and become one of his little peppers. Until next time, that's a wrap.
Those are my seven. I really hope you agree. I hope you enjoy watching their videos. Please go and give them some love in the comments and go and subscribe to their channels. Who is your favorite undiscovered running YouTuber? UK or worldwide, doesn't matter, but don't tell us about the big ones, the ones with hundreds of thousands of subscribers. We know who they are. Tell us about somebody who we may never have heard of before, who's got a tiny channel, but who does great work and really deserves a little bit more support and a few more subscribers. Remember, we are in the middle of the Cape Wrath Ultra video series at the moment. A new episode every Friday, 6 p.m. UK time. I'd really appreciate it if you go and watch. I put a lot of love and effort into these episodes, so I really hope you enjoy watching them. The link is right there to go and see the latest episode. Remember, a new one on Friday, and I'll see you guys on the start line next time. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.